have to uh, get Scoot in here because Argus is moving. Yeah. Herc sonar. Sorry. Am I now? At like two meters per division. So we're going to come up vertical and then we'll peek over the edge of the cliff. And then we'll come forward again and then we'll hit another wall. Just stepping up, working our way up. All right, you can um, just get a move program to the ship. Bridges Nav, please continue uh, zero five, call this zero five zero again. I was letting our science experts in the back row give me a <laughs> she was description. She was throwing softballs. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just lobbing it up for the back row. <laughs> Take it home. Take it home. Appears to be some sort of rock. <laughs> <laughs> it appears to be sitting. Not megafauna. Hope you're a fan of rocks. You got it so good. Gotcha. Somewhere there's a geologist that's just enthralled by Nautilus Live right now. Yep. Sure there is. If you are a geologist enthralled by Nautilus Live right now, send us a message. He's coming right for us. Oh, wow. I was close. Off we go. So there is a coral in the... Oh, we're too far up, I guess, now. Distracted by a cucumber. What coral is that? I can't quite tell from here. There are a bunch of um, bamboo corals that look kind of like that, but bamboo corals have little nodes in between them. What's this guy in the background here, Eric? A little bit of life on the end of it. Doesn't look too healthy. Polyps. Glad to hear people writing in are enjoying the highlight videos from yesterday. Very cool spider crabs, very cool octopus seen yesterday. Over to the right a little bit, As our chief scientist did mention, there is more life the shallower we go. There's more food available, and uh, we're expecting so to see more and more corals on the way up.